Is there anything in your phone that you're scared of us seeing? Just nudes. Okay, fine. <laughs> My nudes. This is Access All Apps, where Radio 1 listeners get to go through the phone of a celebrity. And today, that celebrity is Lewis Capaldi. He said he's got nudes on his phone. Will we get to see them? Perhaps. It's not like nudes, nudes. It's more like I was trying to take a picture of my... I've got hemorrhoids. <laughs> I was trying to take a picture of my hemorrhoids to see, like... Like, you can't... You, unless you see it. I, I may have done this before yeah, as yeah. well. Am I the only one in this room is who it, hasn't tried you, to take pictures of the hemorrhoids? Did you yeah, put yeah. the camera on selfie mode well, and squat no, over what it? I did was, what I did was I put my legs in the air <laughs> and, I got a, and I got a mirror. Access all apps. <laughs> let's get back to it. Let's, Lewis. Sorry, sorry, yeah. Let's have our first one. Hi, it's Johnny. What I would like to know is what was the last thing you searched on the internet? The last thing you searched on the internet. Let me have a little look Unlock here. Unlock your phone. Right. <laughs> I won't tell you the last thing I said. Why? You ever heard of a bell of danger? What's a bell of da- a bell of danger? A bell of danger. She's just a actress. Oh, oh. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why were you searching her? <laughs> just I got I felt lonely oh. last night. Um, <laughs> you know the house that you just bought. Are you living in it on your own? Yeah. Can you tell? <laughs> <laughs> um, Should we do another one? Hi Vic and Jordan, this is Emma from the Wirral. I would like to see what the last message was on Instagram. Mm. Right, okay. So I've got two Instagrams. Oh, do you? I've got a, I've got a secret one. <gasps> and I've got the one that I, I use. Oh. My front-facing one. And my last message on my main one, I went to see this guy, Mark Rabili, last night. Mark Rabili, I don't know if I'm saying that correctly. But he's like this comedian... Like musician, he's incredible. Okay. So the last message is like a, is like a story. Story from him. I should mention I'm slightly hungover. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's clear. I, I definitely. Lewis, we love you. Yeah, we that, love you so good, much. Yeah, listen, it's good to be back. And then the one before that was from Kygo. Oh. He tagged me in a reel. I wrote this song for him and Dean Lewis. You guys didn't put it in the playlist. That's cool. Um, <laughs> Love me yet. Oh, it's on the playlist now. <laughs> right, let's do another one. Hi, this is Soraya from Norfolk, and I would like to know when was the last time you were blocked on WhatsApp and why? <gasps> eh, blocked? Yeah, yeah, do you think you've been blocked by him? I don't know. think I have been blocked on WhatsApp. Before. Nobody had blocked Lewis Capaldi, would they? I don't think I've ever been, been blocked on what? I don't think I've ever blocked anybody either. On uh, what on what about on like Twitter or Instagram? Mm, you Trump. never block anyone. Well, because it's like if I want to block someone, I just I just close. I just won't look at it. It's a good way to be. It's like that thing that Ricky Gervais says. You wouldn't go into like the town centre and see a sign that says guitar lessons and scream on it and scream at it. I don't want guitar lessons. <laughs> yeah. just, just just walk away from it. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's a very good point. That's true. Right, let's do another one. Hi, my name's Emily, I'm from Alton Broad, and I would like to type in the word dislike on WhatsApp and see what comes up. Let's do it. It's a message that isn't from me. Okay, Mm -hmm. that's fine. It's from (laughs) someone who works with me. Okay. um, That's saying, I really didn't think I could dislike the guy more. (gasps) Oh, And it's about a singer. Oh! Can you say... I can't see. Can you give any clues? I mean, I'll just show you. Interesting. <laughs> oh, interesting. He's, he's, a, he's, he's lovely. A, he's a great guy. He's a lovely guy. And I and I disagreed with the person after this. And did you back his corner? Yeah, I did. Oh, that's good of you. Right, we'll do one more. Hi, my name's Dave. I would like to know. Oh, my name's Dave. <laughs> sorry, go on, you go. Sorry. On your oh, phone. my name's Dave. <laughs> Oh no, Dave. <laughs> sorry, Dave. <laughs> no, I'm just saying that. Just, I wasn't expecting it at all. <laughs> Just, oh, insult, like, Dave. just insult our listeners. No, 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 sorry. I love Dave. Dave, <laughs> it was just quite an interesting way to say that. Who do you did, love you even hear, did you even hear what he said? No. Okay. Hi, my name's Dave. I would like to know, using the various payment services available on your phone, what was the last thing you bought over £100? My banking app doesn't work on my phone because I updated to, to this iOS 16 beta. Do mm. you know, like the beta? Where it's yeah. Like, it's rubbish. I don't do the updates Let me make anymore. that clear. Let me make that clear. That's one thing that I want to get off my chest. Yeah. I don't update it until it's ready to be updated because I have been burned. But the last thing I bought over £100, I had lunch yesterday. 
What did you eat? It was in London. You don't g- yeah, don't gas. Yeah, this I, place is a ridiculous. <laughs> this was a joke <laughs> down here. I can have food in Glasgow. Twenty pounds, two people, delightful meal. Yeah, down here it's an absolute. It's disgusting. It's sick. Look, you don't need to preach to us. I'm from Newcastle. He's from Burnley. Yeah, yeah but that's at the northern. Is Burnley in the north? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. northern Isles. Come on. <laughs> what did you eat that was over £100? I had, I had a, I, had, I won't swear, I had a salad. A what? What? I had a salad. My friend had a steak. Oh, oh, fine, there you go. go. Yeah. So maybe it's my it's my gluttonous friend that I need to be, I need to be doing my way. But I had a salad. How mad's that? And yeah. it was terrible. Lewis, um, yes. you know that you've got like a special relationship with Scott and he's left now. Yes. Would you just like happily come and tip up on our show at any time? I know that Absolutely, sounds really yeah. desperate. Like- See to me, you guys are my new Scott and Chris. Oh, thank you. Go. Thank oh, you. thanks. Well, it's so good to have you back. Well, uh, can I say something, Vic? Go on. It's good to be back. <gasps> Lewis, you're a gentleman. <laughs>